to do alternate picking uh, with the thumb and the one finger uh, only and that's all I'm going to use is a thumb and the one finger like a downstroke and a backstroke you do with a flat pick but using your fingers okay this little two minute tune I'm just going to kind of improvise over top of that and then after it's done I'll show you some techniques and how to apply it here we go Seven fret of the fifth string and the five seven fret of the fourth string and the five seven fret of the third string. Uh, if I'm going to do a lick like this, I'm going to start with my finger, and that's going to seem odd for a lot of people. Uh, you have to get used to starting with the finger and starting with the thumb, depending on the lick that you're going to play. If I'm going to do a lick like this, I will intuitively know, and it will just come to you after a while. Start with the finger for this particular lick. And what you do usually, not 100% of the time, you're going to alternate from the finger to the thumb, finger to the thumb, like this. <laughs> Just to mix it up, 
uh, for different licks, you'll just find that's just the way it's going to be. For something like this, I would start with the thumb. And again, now, it's not, it's not a, a written rule, it's not written in stone that you are at no time going to do maybe a couple of notes with your finger and a couple of notes with your thumb in a row. Absolutely. For effect, for dynamics, for attack, I do that quite often. Here's a good example. If I'm going to do this lick, uh, I'll start with the uh, thumb, finger, and then I'll keep the finger going. So there's three or four notes with the finger. Because I wanted that attack. To do a really good little exercise, uh, you, can, you can do all kinds of little things around the A minor pentatonic scale. Just keep them really short, short little licks, and start with the finger on one occasion, start with the thumb. If that feels goofy to you, then try the alternative, because one of them will, will lead you better into playing the next string that you want to play, depending on the lick you want to play. So, for example, I'm going to start with the finger on this, on the third string on the fifth fret. And I'm going to go to the thumb on the 7th fret. Now a couple of times there I screwed up and did a couple of hammers and pull-offs, which I shouldn't have done because I wasn't trying to show you that. But you get the idea. Basically, just start with thumb and one finger and keep picking every note. Okay. If you get that technique down, the thumb to finger, or finger, thumb, finger, thumb, the alternate picking, get that down really smooth. Then when it comes time to start doing incorporating pull-offs, hammer-ons, and slides, you'll have no trouble uh, stopping one finger and putting a slide in there or a hammer or a pull-off. And believe me, when you start doing that, your fingers, your, your thumb and your finger, well, they will start to know, even your second finger, once you get your second finger going in there, your, your fingers and your thumb will start to know just how much time you actually have to, to, uh, to throw in a lick after a hammer on and a pull off. You've got tons and tons of time. It really is cool. You have to take my word on this. If you practice the, the ultimate picking technique, thumb and one finger, back and forth, and pick every note for a good two, three, four weeks. <laughs> incorporating hammers and poles and slides with that technique and you will be amazed how fast and how clean you will be. There you go. I hope these tips help and if you like the video please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Also don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I have the links listed below uh, to check out my website where you can have access to my books and some free downloads and please sign up to my email list to receive cool updates and more free stuff post your comments and questions anything you want to maybe see um, things you might want to learn check out techniques and stuff i love answering that and I'll, I'll love to make a video for that kind of stuff down the road until next time bye now mm -hmm.